What is the, what is the black population here in America? Thirty. Is it thirty-two million? What is our percentage? About twelve percent. About twelve percent. Right. So I never heard in, in my lifetime, and I'm an older gentleman now. In my lifetime, any black man's interest diverging from black women. It's black people. It's a black people interest. So when did? a black man have an interest separate from black people. We all are black people and what's good for black people is good for the common good. So there's no such thing as as far as I'm concerned about a black man's interest. You know, it's a black people interest. And that's what we have to look at. And then when you talk about the Democratic Party, the Democratic Party, we have to have some serious conversations after this campaign. Not before this campaign, right now, we have to get out here and address and get our, our person elected. This isn't the time to diverge and, 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 and sit on the couch and say, I got some issues. We will, we will do, there's plenty of time to deal with that after the election, but not at this time. We have to move forward. We've got to get our person in. It's a very close election, but I'm looking at the polls. I'm looking at uh, different things. And I, uh, and I think the data is suggesting that we are going to be victorious. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Attorney Avery Bradman is setting the record straight for us, and we appreciate that. Pat Mason's been with the Mildred Gaddis Show for years, yes, for years. Yes, yes. You're on social media. Uh, how, how are you feeling about what you're seeing and what people are saying? Well, as of late, I've been on TikTok. Caucasian people, yes, really, really voted for Harris. Surprises, and I'm just, I'm just so uh, happy to see that. And to piggyback on the uh, on the black men, I'm just talking to the black men who think or who says she's a woman. I can't vote for 